hello everyone and welcome to another Roaring Records tutorial. Today I'm going to be talking about stretching audio to fit a particular track in <coughs> Soundtrap. So we're going to take a little look at Soundtrap here and what I've done is I have downloaded a loop right now and first of all I know that in my head like my favorite go-to tempo is 96 so uh, I'm going to set that tempo here in Soundtrap so that um, it's moving at 96 BPM. But then I'm going to uh, drag in this WAV file that I've got that is a loop. And I'm going to take a look. And oh no, this loop is at 103 tempo. Oh man. So can I not use the loop? No, there is a solution. If you hold the Alt or Option key, you will notice right here on the screen that this Trim button becomes an arrow that moves both ways. So I know that my 103 is faster than my 96, and so this is an 8-measure loop. I want to make it match the end of the 8th measure. So hold Alt, click, and drag. And then Soundtrap's going to do its thing. And it is now stretching this audio to move it to my tempo of 96. So if I turn my Met on and I listen. There it was, stretched out, met right where it needed to. So anytime you want to use a loop that's like a pre-made something, you drag it and drop it in, um, you can do that. This also works for MIDI files. Um, it also works uh, just in stretching different things. You could double the tempo of this if you wanted to. Make like an up-tempo thing. You could make it half the, sp half the length, which would double the speed. And then you got something like this. So this is very useful for remixing and uh, working with samples and stuff like that. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, feel free to click like and subscribe.